Welcome back everybody to another episode of One More Goal, the no cheat playthrough because of the cheat uh, uh, playthrough of Unreal Goal that I used cheats in last time. Okay, we're continuing from where we left off. We have to bathe in the water. Summon the demon, I guess. This is the fall of thunder. Impure souls who bathe in the water shall face the demon that came from the stars. Of course, it has to be down to the pool. The demons came down from the stars in a metal chariot as punishment for the sins of the night. Oh, see me here. Oh god. Oh, hey, actually I need that. Boing. 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 This guy can take jumps like no one's business. This is the obelisk of clouds. Beyond here lies a pool of thunder. To reach a pool of thunder, one must climb the loose stones. Powerful strength comes from the, those who let the waterfall wash over them at the pool of pool thunder. Beware those of impure motors who enter the pool of thunder shall face the demon from the stars. What's my motive? I'd like to know that. Hey! Take the stick of stick of six fires and go forth to the inner ceremonial chamber where you should there you shall find your you shall find your way back to the place from whence you came in the metal chariot that fell from the stars. The six came from the gnarly water well when the star fell from the sky to climb the star one must pass through the ceremonial wing. The eight ball. Nothing special. That's kind of a kind of badass. Kind of reminds me of a lot of Quake. Oh, I'll show you something cool. Talk about giving. Primary fire, and then you hold down secondary fire. It sends the um, missiles in a circle. I think that's what happens, anyways. But this is where uh, the scuba gear comes in. Where it comes in handy. Ow! Son of a bitch! Because I really enjoy it, and I think you guys enjoy it, will enjoy it as well. Oh, what's here? Oh, what's here? Okay. Yeah, might as well take it. In the test in Napoli, there's a marine scuba gear that replenishes its air, so that's kind of helpful. But I'm just gonna let myself. Oh! Oh, okay, never mind. Kind of needed. Fuck. Oh, that gave me a heart attack. I 
I mean, literally, that scared the shit out of me. I was not expecting it. Man, I play this game a thousand times, guys. Do you believe me? I think this is where I get more ammo. Now, I'm gonna have to save here because this is one of those times that. If I don't be careful, I can actually die. As you can tell by the burning lava, and usually there's a scar here. Yes, see? Oh, uh, well, a couple of well placed ASMD shots, he's dead. Oh, that's kind of cool, I never realized I actually did that. It's amazing how much how much the world is better with um, full graphics. Anyways, I digress, let's continue. I think this is where I go. Oh, no. I'm thinking of also getting a I'm thinking of also getting this on What are you guys thoughts on that? I've seen place with it, it looks brilliant. That works interesting. The game looks like it could be a lot of fun. It's like a game that has replayability, I mean like in chaos endings like you can get low or high and those are depending on how the cat um those uh and that chaos rating changes the way characters react to it. Oh! Oh! Yeah. I can't stop this shit. Ow! Go away. Finally, shoot you in the face. Look, armor. Oh, I forgot about this part. And splat. This is a tricky part. There's no inscriptions on the walls. Oh wait, this. Sergeant William Bradford. My entire squad has been killed by these salamander things. There's no ammo left and I've been holding up at this train for with one of the native priests for days. While he prays, I try and keep a watchful eye at the door. You're welcome. I practically saved you. Go down. Trials begin. Yep. Give the fuck. Yeah, I really wish I didn't waste that ASMD now. Anyways. Actually, what's down here? I forgot. There's also a weapon in this game called the Quad Shot. And I'd show it in one of my videos. Of course, I'm going to spawn it because. It's one of, this was one of those unfinished weapons that you could only spawn in, you can only get by spawning it in. And of course if I spawn it in, uh, people, people got it. Oh shit. People 
Minecraft, they're not the same. You are a legend player. You used hacks. Oh well. Oh shit. Whoa. Pistol tap. Now if I had a sniper rifle, it would be the next one. Probably. I'm gonna snipe him with this pistol. I'd be interested to see what the caliber of this um, pistol is. Okay, not watch this. <laughs> cool. But I pretty much I'm like, oh, okay no. <laughs> Usually there's beaky moss up there, but obviously I play on servers. I just raised it six rounds. Go me. Ooh, crystals. I think we're almost to the end yet, boy. I think this weapon also has targeting. What the hell happened to the core? Probably the missile's probably centered. Centered away. Let's see what happens all. Cool. I didn't get a sniper rifle until later. In Left Ever Smoke, I believe. So when I get jump it's gonna have to be like I'm going to have to be Cautious with them because they're not everlasting. And they can, uh, um, they can, I can, I uh, be, I, I can be, um, they can fade, so, yeah. What was that sound? Anyways, people, this has been um, part three of the Unreal Gold No Cheap playthrough. If you have enjoyed this playthrough, please with a comment, rate it, and subscribe. And this has been Zealot196. I hope you have enjoyed this um, video. So, this has been Zealot196 or Zealot Coils, signing off.